in that last video we completed working rule procedure for zero velocity so in this video we are going to start a type 2 model non zero velocity so we have to write as well as usual one dimensional wave equation dou square y divided by dou t square equal to a square into dou square y divided by dou x square so after that we have to write the conditions for non zero velocity y equal to 0 when x equal to 0 first condition second condition y equal to 0 when x equal to l that condition here changed y equal to 0 when t equal to 0 in zero velocity you will have that condition zero velocity model dou y by dou t equal to 0 here we changed y equal to 0 t equal to 0 and fourth condition dou y by dou t is equal to f of x when t equal to 0 what is this f of x depend upon your problem you have to mention here here i given generally f of x you should not write in uh, during the exam f of x you have to write what is mentioned in your problem that's you have to write here dou by dou t equal to f of x and uh, the suitable solution is so this suitable solution is common for uh, zero velocity and non zero velocity for one dimensional wave equation y equal to a cos px plus b sin px into c cos pat plus d sin pat which is our equation one so in this uh, video i'm not going to stall step one and step two which means equation two and equation three i'm not going to solve because this is common for uh, whether zero velocity or non zero velocity in last video i given brief explanation for uh, step one and step two in this uh, video i'm not going to prove this step one step two just i given here uh, step one when applying condition one i will get uh, this equation y equal to b sin px c cos pat plus d sin pat put equation number two and step two we have to apply condition two in equation two so i will get this equation y equal to b sin n pi x by l into c cos n pi a t by l plus d sin n pi a t by l so this is our equation three these two equations already we solved in zero velocity model so that here i didn't given that working rules just i given the equations so we will start uh, we will start uh, equation uh, we will start condition 3 substitution onwards i will start with applying condition 3 so in this equation 3 we have to apply condition 3 here uh, in non zero velocity our condition will change y equal to 0 and t equal to 0 substitute in equation 3 left hand side y equal to 0 right hand side b sin n pi x by l and c cos n pi a t by l here you can substitute t equal to 0 the entire term 0 so we return cos 0 plus d sin n pi a t by l t equal to 0 means entire term 0 so now we can write 0 equal to b sin n pi x by l and c cos 0 is 1 d into sin 0 0 the entire term 0 now simplify this 0 equal to b c sin n pi x by l so after this we have to compare this b c sin n pi x l term and equation 3 which one equal to 0 which one not equal to 0 we have to write c your equation 3 b and sin n pi x by l here b c sin n pi x by l so that here uh, we cannot be able to take b c equal to 0 so it is b c b not equal to 0 and sin n pi x by l also not equal to 0 when we taken this both b and sin n pi x by l equal to 0 means your entire equation 3 becomes 0 so that's not possible so it is not equal to 0 the only trivial solution we can take c equal to 0 in zero velocity when substituting condition 3 you will get d equal to 0 here c equal to 0 so substitute this c equal to 0 in equation 3 in equation 3 you can substitute c equal to 0 from this equation 3 c equal to 0 means the entire cost term will eliminate so i am writing 
y equal to b sin n by x by l and c into c0 means the entire term 0 plus d sin n by at by l. So simply way this term y equal to I am writing bd sin <coughs> n pi x by l and sin n pi at by l. In zero velocity here you will get bc sin n pi x by l cos n pi at by l. In non-zero velocity you will get bd sin n pi x by l sin n pi at by l because of this d term. There will be c here d. So after this we cannot be able to eliminate all the terms when substituting condition 4 because all the terms are product form. So simply we can take bd equal to cn. Finally I will explain why I taken here cn. So you know that the most you know that the most general solution the most general solution is we can write y equal to sum of n is equal to 1 to infinity. Why we are applying here sum of n equal to 1 to infinity because of this bd constant equal to we taken generally cn. If you taken cn now what is this n we have to define that is I am writing by superposition principle 1 to infinite number of terms we don't know what it is. So cn sin n pi x by l and sin n pi a t by l ok. So this is our equation 4 up to this you will get 8 mark while finding equation 4 you will get 8 mark power. So this is for uh, non-zero velocity model fourth equation. So after that in that uh, general the most general solution that is our equation 4. In that equation 4 we have to apply our condition 4. But in this non-zero velocity our condition 4 is dou y by dou t equal to f of x and t equal to 0. Our equation 4 in terms of y we cannot be able to apply directly that condition 4. So before applying condition 4 we have to partially differentiate equation 4 with respect to t. So y differentiation with respect to t I am writing dou y by dou t is equal to sum of n is equal to 1 to infinity cn constant and sin n pi x by l also constant and sin n pi a t by l we have to differentiate because here we have t term. So sin n pi a t by l differentiation cos n pi a t by l and inner term differentiation of t the coefficient we have to write n pi a by l. Now I am going to substitute condition 4 dou y by dou t equal to f of x and t equal to 0 in the above equation okay not in equation 4 in this above equation we have to substitute that values so i am writing f for dou y by dot is equal to f of x and right hand side sum of n is equal to 1 to infinity c n sin n pi x by l into n pi a by l and cos t equal to 0 cos 0 so here i am writing sum of n is equal to 1 to infinity c n into n pi a by l into sin n pi x by l ok and left hand side you will have f of x this this f of x depend upon your problem. So usually when substituting condition 4 the end uh, equation should be in form of half range sign series already you know that but here we cannot uh, form half range sign series why because here we have cn into one more constant n pi a by l so that here I am going to substitute this cn into n pi a by l 
is equal to Bn. Okay. When substituting this, you will get half range sine series. Sum of n is equal to 1 to infinity Bn sine n pi x by L. So, which is represent right hand side, uh, which is represent right hand side of range sine series. Okay. So, we can be able to find Bn. What is the formula? Bn equal to 2 by L integral 0 to L f of x sine n pi x by L into dx. So, usually after finding Bn, we are substituting in uh, equation 4 in that uh, zero velocity model. But here we cannot be able to apply Bn. Why? Because here Cn. Now you understood why we written here Cn. Because when uh, applying Cn here, finally when substituting condition 4, we converted into Bn. Otherwise, uh, we can't be able to find Bn value. Okay. So, here after finding Bn, in this Cn n pi a by L equal to, you will have Bn. Here, we have to substitute this Bn value. Then, uh, based on this, you will get Cn equal to Bn into L divided by n pi a. Here, you can substitute Bn, you will get Cn. Now, this Cn you can substitute in our equation 4. So, this is our uh, final answer for uh, non-zero velocity. So, again now I will revise that uh, non-zero velocity working rule. So, usually you know that we have to write first one dimensional wave equation. Then we have to write the conditions for uh, non-zero velocity models and a suitable solution. Uh, when substituting condition 1 in equation 1, we will get equation 2. In that equation 2, we have to apply condition 2 we will get equation 3. After that, in that equation 3, we have to substitute condition 3. We will get the final answer, the most general solution. In this equation 4, usually we are applying uh, condition 4. But here, this uh, equation 4 is in terms of y. But our condition 4 is dou y by dou t. So, partially differentiate before applying condition 4. Then you can substitute here. You will get... Uh, entirely new equation which is not a half range sign series because here you will have cn into n pi a by l so that here you can substitute uh, that uh, this cn into n pi a by l equal to bn now you will get half range uh, sign series right hand side so we can able to find uh, bn after finding bn you can find cn substitute in this uh, cn into n pi a by l equal to bn so you will get cn then finding cn you can substitute that Cn value in our equation 4. That is our uh, final result. So, in this video, we completed non-zero velocity working procedure. And uh, before that, we completed uh, zero velocity model procedures also. Both you can uh, study well once you can practice. So, after that, uh, you can go for the problems. In next video, we will start the problems how to solve. So, in every problem, whether it is a zero velocity or non-zero velocity, you have to write up to step 4. It is common for every problem in one-dimensional wave equation. So, that before going to start the problem, I given this working rule for both the cases. While starting the problem, I will not uh, teaching this up to step 4. Straight away, we will go for the BN. Thank you, Pa.